here in his uh, semi-final. So Hunfelt on the left. This is for the first of two bronze medals available in the men's 81 kilos. The German, 22 years old, up against a man just a year older. Both start cautiously with an extreme right against right stance, keeping each other at great distance. Big throw, get countered. Mazzari. Hanfeld came across for a hip sweep. Harai Goshi threw his hip too far out. And he got countered by Goto no Aga. Early advantage to the uh, Moldovan then. Got an Oaga, European under 23 champion a couple of years ago. And now a Wazari up against Janusz Hunfeld of Germany. Both had fight fights before this match. We the saw their earlier fights, both are very explosive throwers as well as strong ground specialist, especially Hunfeld. Who won several of his matches on the ground with a very unusual turnover. Something we don't really see every day. So whether he's going to pull it out here, that's uh, to be seen. Still a long way to go in this match. 2 minutes 27 seconds. Does the Moldovan try and defend that Wazari? Play it safe. Clearly they, they have to attack, he doesn't want to pick up any penalties, but it's a fine line isn't it, between putting yourself out there on the line and risking losing that Wazari. That's true in Nippon. Exactly. Now, penalty for passivity, it's kind of, it would suggest that maybe he's trying to hold back right. and trying to defend. Maybe he's listening to our advice. <laughs> He doesn't want to listen to my advice. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> well, Gotenow Aga lands on his rear but gets pushed onto his back. That scores Hanfield and Wazari. So now they're both even. All square with the Moldovan uh, penalty to his name. Minute 30 to go. It's really hard to say which way this match is going to go. Oh, oh. big Uchimata from the German. It almost went to the German. Well defended from the Moldovan. Well, both of them have very good ability to turn out of the, their opponent's attack as we've seen from the earlier matches and from this position they're limiting what they can do as far as techniques go hence the attempts at foot sweeps exactly and in. we're sort of in a golden score situation aren't we really because the next person to score wins this medal good point in practice, it is. Penalty to the German. German with a false attack. Penalty. That's what the referee saying. Oh, oh what that's, a throw. That was not a false attack. That was a really big throw. But the Moldovan didn't land on his back. So there was no score there. No score. You can see the Let's just see this again. Oh, Over he goes. Oh, oh, onto his head. And, and managed to just twist round so he didn't land on his back. 
I'm so impressed by the Moldovan's ability to turn out from these big attacks. Time's up. Well, you couldn't get more even than that, could you? Wazari each, penalty each, into golden score. On the clock, a second penalty going toward the German. Passivity. Another oh. big with Shimada. He really manages to get the lift. Now the Moldovan trying to get a, trying to get a hold on. It's not to be. German coach looks to be frustrated. Oh, oh that is an Ipon. That's a huge Ipon from Gotunoraka. What a throw, and the German landing full square on his back. The coach can't believe it. He throws his arms in the air. Pumfeld so close to winning a bronze medal. But Dorin Gotonoaga of Moldova, the 23-year-old European under-23 champion from a couple of years ago, takes the bronze medal. And that is Moldova's first judo medal at these universiads. Uh, we saw several times the German on field throwing for the Uchimata or Harai Goshi and didn't land his opponent on his back. See this Kouchi Makakumi attempt from the German. And now you can see the big Uchimata gets the lift, but just misses the rotation, landing the Moldova onto his head to allow him to spin out. And once again, another big Uchimata landing Koto Noaga onto his head. But then right after that, you can see this is another angle attack it's the big Ipon I'm waiting for yeah this is where the Moldovan turned the table with the big Makikomi Harai Makikomi Soto Makikomi type of winding technique flatly throwing his opponent onto the back job done for Dorin Gotonawaga